So I'm here at Spruce Grouse Lake and I'm going to read a Perimiac. Well, that's how you pronounce it, right? Uh, Perimiac? Perimiac? Like I don't know something where the like accent that. comes, but... All right. Well, in any case, um, this poem is called Waterton's Great Circle Route and I wrote it July 18th, 2024. There are trails with a great destination, with a waterfall, lake view, or canyon. Twin Lakes Trail has a lake panoramic beyond Tamarack Trail's inspiration. Forest blooms to entice your companion. Viewing Blackiston Creek's dioramic is long lasting. You follow it winding through the valley and dense vegetation, all in bloom with the fireweed that's flaming, regrowth tamarack slopes you keep finding. This creek's falls are a wader's temptation. Beneath mountains and flowers they're framing. Twin Lakes Trail has not one main attraction. This trail ends and begins with a canyon and has waterfalls, lake views, and fountains. Though it's calming, there's plenty of action, so it surely won't bore your companion. It's a beautiful hike in the mountains. Yeah, always bring at least one companion, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah. Even though we haven't seen mountains. any evidence of bears on this one. Uh, not really, yeah, nope. o just old, old uh, droppings. Yeah, so, uh, well, I'll okay. tell you in a while. Okay. So anyway, I'm going to show you a few of the lovely um, scenes just from where I am. So you can look up there. That's very pretty. Yeah, that's Mount Kishenana or Kishenana, something all like that. There. That is too. Yeah. Cliff there, rock face. And it's a it's a very pretty lake. And yeah. James and I have found that this is the one point in the trail that really has the most blooms a lot of the time. Well, I so, think it is the most appealing point on the yes, trail. Yes, definitely. Uh, it's a nice little lake. Yep. You know, your first time you walk it, you're just not expecting it. Mm -hmm. Every time you walk it, yep. you are expecting it, uh, yes. which is an important uh, sort of thing. Yes. It's not uh, flowery like it was when we first came up here. It must no, have been we're, uh, springtime. we're hiking this later than yeah, normally. Exactly right. There was but, one little pond. Uh, yeah, just there were still the quite a few here, flowers there. South here. Yeah. Uh, it's always seems to have some nice flowers and things like that, yeah. but it's very green because a lot of the rock face back of the wall, rock wall has green in it. Oh, yes, well it does. Red. Yeah. So this, uh, excuse me, a lot of little mountain lights are green, but this one I think is especially green. Because especially of the, green, yes. There's, uh, there's lots of green, not just evergreen mm -hmm. uh, down low. And the water even looks green here. So Spruce Grouse Lake. It's very pretty. A nice place to take a rest while you're hiking the Great Circle yeah, Route. Yeah, it's close to half. So the Great Circle yeah. Route is basically Laxton Creek, part of Tamarack Trail that will join you up to Snowshoe Trail and then back to Red Rock Canyon. So yep. you start at Red Rock Canyon, following mentioned that ending point. And you end there. And you end there. So it's a scenic you, on Blackiston Creek uh, Trail. Mm -hmm. You walk by Blackiston Falls, but there are lots of little falls. Oh, on, on I the way. I should mention that you actually have to go off the trail just slightly. See, oh, the trail okay. is right there, mm -hmm. and it's yeah, it's just barely off the trail, and you find this Spruce Grouse Lake. Mm 